2017 Division II State of Ohio, 120 pounds. Here we have Jordan Crace from St. Paris Graham in the black singlet with the white trim. He does get a first takedown here. It's open period. And his opponent, Joe Wright from Akron, able to get an escape there. It's 2-1 in favor of Crace. Early on here in the first. Jordan Trace, the sophomore from St. Paris Graham, as I mentioned. He's undefeated on the year. Twenty-six and zero. His opponent, Joe Wright from Akron Coventry. As he tries a little bit of offense here of his own, looking for a takedown is Joe Wright. But able to convert as Crace comes around the side there and scores two of his own. 4-1 is the lead now for Jordan Crace. And Joe Wright on the bottom there is down by three. Joe Wright, the junior from Coventry. Got a 33 and 9 record. And he's got his hands full here in the quarterfinal in the quarterfinal match against Crace, the returning state placer from last year. Four to two now after that escape from the Coventry wrestler. Crace on the edge looking for two, but referee says they're out of bounds. Crace tries to duck, but Wright grabs the leg. And time runs out in the first period. Four to two in favor of the St. Paris Graham wrestler. Crace defers, and Wright chooses down in the second period. Down by two, we've got a caution on bottom. Down by two is the wrestler from Coventry, as he looks to get an escape, and there it is. Only down by one now, three to four. And Crace is looking for that low pick. Not able to get it, but a little bit of a scramble there. And Joe Wright ends up coming out the back door, and he's looking to score on his own. And the referee calls out of bounds. Three to four now, got a great match going here. This is the second period. 1.30 left in that second period. Out of bounds. As I mentioned, Trace, the returning state placer, taken third last year in Division II at 106 pounds. Puts on some weight now. He's up at 120. This is 120 pounds. And he's looking to be a two-year placer going into the semifinals. Inside a minute now. Second period. Score is four to three in favor of Jordan Grace.
wrestlers firing off quite a bit of offense in the first portion of this match, resigning themselves to setups now. 10 seconds left in the second period, four to three. Trace now trying to get two right before the end of this second. And he does in fact convert with one second left on the clock in the second period. And that is two for Crace. And he's gonna sport a three point lead. Six to three now going into the third period. One second on the clock here. Just a quick ride out to get us into the third. And wrestlers will switch positions as it's Crace's choice. And he's gonna choose down. Start of the third period. Crace up by three, scores six to three. And looking for a reversal here. Referee does score the reversal, and now Joe Wright in a little bit of trouble as he's going to give up two near fall on that reversal. So that's a four point swing in favor of Crace now as he takes the lead 10 to three. 130 left in this match. St. Paris Green coach is now asking for a major out of this as they are looking for additional team points. And so what was a close match in the second period is now a six point lead. Make that five as he gives up the escape. But wanting to, wanting to look for two and he gets it there. Out of a minute. Grace in firm control now as he tries for a turn. Twelve to four score, fifty four seconds left in this match. Crace is looking for a tilt. Got one swipe from the referee, no near fall points had added. 12 to four still. Inside of 30 seconds now, as Crace looking for a turn. Joe Wright gets a stall warning on the bottom there. Referee goes ahead and stops the action, calls a stalemate. Ten seconds left, and Trace will reset on top and be happy to take a major victory into the semifinals. We do get near fall, actually. I'll take that back. We're going to add two near fall. So, Crace your winner and moves on to the semifinals.